Hey guys, it's Carl Brown from GuitarLessons365.com. Today we're going to learn another Christmas tune. It's going to be Feliz Navidad by Jose Feliciano. So this one's a fun one. It's got a couple of, uh, it's got one really cool uh, uh, strumming pattern to practice um, and really three different chord progressions. Now I didn't play, we're in standard tuning here, I didn't play the intro to the song, which is, uses kind of the same chords. It sounds like this. All right, so uh, what we're gonna do, you know, it has all the, all that stuff going on. All these, he plays different instruments and multiple guitars, but we're kind of keeping it just to the guitar chords itself for this one. Um, now the rhythm is kind of cool. Let me just show you the chords real quick. We're gonna have the D major chord, then the G. Now this is the G major that has the open B string in it. Not so it's not that if you're used to playing that. And then the A major chord. You can play that with a bar any kind of fingering you like to play using an A. And then we're back to the D. So it's D, G, A, D. Now the rhythm is, uh, we can kind of, he uses this rhythm underneath the intro here and the uh, verse of the song, uh, or the Feliz Navidad section of the song. And when he switched to English, he does full strumming. So let's take a look at this rhythm. Now, what you wanna do is, every time you start playing the rhythm, you're just gonna do a down, up, and then you're gonna do a muted, strum. So what that means is the really the back of your palm hits the strings, lays down on the strings at the same time you're picking across them. So we have this, you just kind of, it's like a percussive hit. So we have this, down, up, all right? So you just did a percussive hit and that was a downstroke on that percussive hit. So from there when we do the rhythm we're going to do an up, down, up, followed by a percussive hit. So up, down, up, mute. Up, down, up. So I suggest just getting uh, that D chord in your hand. Remember, start with two, then. So it's a good, uh, it has a lot of momentum to it. All right, so after you get that, G and A, and back to the D. Repeat. All right, so at the end of this thing, you just hit that chord and then the vocals come in. All right, from there, uh, we just go to the standard verse, which uses the same chords, but just in a different order. You're gonna start now with G, then the A, and then the D played twice as long. So we have this. So you're doing that pattern twice on each chord, except for the D, you're gonna do it four times. Now here I'm starting with down, just down up first though, remember? Then the full pattern. Repeat. And just repeat. Then we got to, uh, I want to wish you a Merry Christmas part of it. And um, this one uses a few more, uh, well, adds a chord to it. And we don't do the muted strum anymore. It's just straight. No mute, it's down, up, down, up, down, up. So we're, the chords are going to be a G to A to that D. And here's going to be the trouble spot a B minor chord. So remember, move your thumb down to the middle of the back of the neck. That's going to allow your fingers to reach this bar. So the fingers are going to be going up instead of kind of angled towards your face. So you have a B minor bar chord. Now this is going to be a bar across the second fret. And you're also going to play the third fret on the B string with your uh, middle finger. Pinky's going to play the fourth fret on the G. And then you're going to have the fourth fret on the D as well. I'm barring basically across five strings. And the tip of my index finger is muting that six string, just in case I hit it during a strum. So we have this. Then back to G. 
A and D. And then you stop after you strum that D a little bit and then you just repeat it. Then we go back to the verse rhythm. This is a G A D, just with a muted riff. So that's under the Feliz Navidad section of it. So, uh, um, so when he's speaking English, full strum. All the other things, just give it that muted feel. All right, hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you again soon for guitarlessons365.com.